Oh, we have new details on an animal cruelty investigation in Pell City. Moments ago, police made additional arrests in the case. CBS 42's Malik Rankin has been following this story. She joins us now live from the scene of a mobile home where 50 cats and dogs were rescued. Malik. That's right. And just moments ago, we watched that arrest take place. We were speaking with the police chief earlier today who said they would be pursuing this couple for 50 counts of animal cruelty and about 15 counts of improper disposal of animal remains. That's because about 15 dead animals were found on the uh, property. I'll let you guys take a look here. Animal control was here. They set up several traps for remaining animals in this area to be brought in and several officers were here as they took away Donna Mullins and her husband. The police chief told us that what he saw today was comparable to conditions that you see for prisoners of war. You know, you see it on TV where people uh, are incarcerated or POWs and they're in horrible conditions. Well, this would, this right here, I guess, would, would rise to that level. The city is working to formally condemn the home. Alabama state law says that for animal cruelty charges, it can be up to one year in prison and or a fine of up to $6,000. But when officers were making an arrest today, this would typically be a misdemeanor class A charge. They said that they were arresting them on felony charges. Live in Pell City, I'm Malik Rankin, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.